hey guys what's up so this is the ninth uh, series of selenium interview question sensors here uh, we will talk about the excel reading writing uh, stuff mr excel methods actually so before to start this is brief about me i come from mechanical background and i have my facebook page and youtube channel where you can subscribe my channel and like my facebook page so that you can ask me the questions on my facebook page and on my youtube once you have subscribed you will have access to all my videos and uh, the all source code will be to my github locations right so let me today it's a small questions but it has more value than any other questions what are the methods of excel reader you have used right so when you say somebody will ask you have you worked with excel sheet you will say usually we say yeah we have worked with excel sheet we have used apache poi but you know how they will catch you they will ask you some methods if you are able to tell they will be convinced if you are not able to tell you will get caught so just remember four or five methods it's enough to fulfill the requirement of the interview you say that in a, any excel sheet when we say excel sheet the excel sheet has lot of workbooks so first what we do in any excel sheets we create the object of the workbook by writing x s f f workbook because here i am using apache poi and this arc workbook will take the path of the excel sheet which to get the path of the excel sheet we make the object of file input stream so file input stream we supply the path of the excel sheet and when we make the object of workbook we supply the path so once we have workbook object created then what we can do from workbook so one workbook will have multiple sheet multiple sheet name right so let me open one excel so just let me open one uh, so this is the workbook when you say this is a sheet name so when i say login test this is one sheet i can add here uh, one more sheet logout so this is another sheet right so complete is a workbook these are the sheets so i made the object of workbook now when i have the object of workbook from workbook i can get sheet index based on let's say login test so i'll get the index based on the index i can do workbook dot get sheet i can get the sheet now once i have the object of sheet and i have made the reference here guys then i can do get of row so any row number i can get from the sheet i can get total number of active rows which means the rows which has a data by writing get cell get last cell number the sheet dot get rows will give you the row number this will give you the number of physical rows active rows this will give you number of cell on that rows on that row actually reference and then let's say you want to get a cell so you can they say that cell dot row dot get cell so from that row i want to get cell number 3 so let's say you have excel sheet you have a row so from row number 4 i want to get the row uh, cell number 3 right this cell number right so what we can do we can write row dot get cell of 3 now how to read the data from the cell we need to just remember if the cell dot get cell type is equal to a string uh, get the data cell dot cell string value if it is a numeric get numeric if it is a boolean get boolean value if you know only this much method right you can crack any interview related to poi people they will ask only this much they expect only this much but generally we don't remember anything in the interview just we will say we know poi but what does mean by poi do you know the methods of poi these are the methods of poi just remember x s s so x s s f just remember this and then you know workbook add x s f f sheet x s s f row x s s f cell so just remember x s s f then add workbook sheet row and cell and just remember this method guys believe me you'll be able to clear but usually even i take interview just people will say i know poi i know how to read the code how to get the cell data but when i ask what is the method name they will say no that i don't know so simple five methods you have to remember right related to excel sheet and just try to remember all these methods you will be good with excel sheet interview questions and the series will continue guys so thank you for watching this if you like this video like my video subscribe my channel and you can like my facebook page thank you guys